So here is a cool little tip for managing your Instagram inbox. To filter messages on Instagram from the home screen, click on your messages icon in the top right corner of the screen to access the inbox. Click on the filter icon, which allows you to filter on either unread or flagged messages. You can switch back and remove the filter at any time simply by clicking on see all. Swiping left on any of your messages gives you additional options to either delete the message or move it from your primary to your general inbox. Or if you click on more, you have the option to either flag or mute messages from that person. Choosing flag marks messages from that person with an orange tag. And then you could use the filter button again to filter on those flagged messages. Swipe left and click more to remove a flag. You can also mute messages from that person, which means you'll no longer be notified when you receive a new message from them. It'll just be there in your inbox the next time you check. So that is how to filter messages on Instagram. If you'd like to know how you can stop people from randomly tagging you in posts, then you might be interested in this. Okay, to tag someone on Instagram, start by swiping left to access the camera app. I'll show you how you can tag people in both posts and stories, but we'll start with stories. Take a photo or hold down the capture button to take a video, and then you have two options. You can either tag someone using a sticker or by using just text. To use the sticker, click on the stickers icon and add the mentioned sticker. Select the person you wish to tag from the list of people you're following or by typing their username. Alternatively, if you prefer not to use a sticker, you can tag them just by adding some text. Click on the text icon and as before, start typing their username prefixed with the at symbol. I'll tag my channel account and once you're happy with your photo or video, click on your stories in the bottom menu. If you prefer to create a post rather than a story, again, in the camera app, swipe across to post and choose either an existing photo from your camera roll or take a new one by clicking on the camera icon. Edit your photo as you wish and when ready, click next. Add a caption, something like, where did you get this with an emoji, click OK, and then you have the option to start tagging people. Tap on the photo and find the person or people you wish to tag. When you're finished tagging people, click done, followed by share to upload your post. If you'd rather not be randomly tagged in posts or at least have the option to decide before being tagged, you have a few choices. You can remove yourself from individual posts by clicking on the post in your timeline and choosing remove me from post. However, if it happens a lot and starts to get annoying, you can enable a setting to manually approve all posts that you're tagged in. To do this, switch over to your profile page and click on the icon that displays all posts you've been tagged in. Open one of these posts and you'll see you have the option to edit. Click edit and tap the switcher to manually approve all tags. Confirm you wish to enable the option noting that it only works on future posts and not existing ones. From here on in, all the posts that you're tagged in will reside in this pending tags page where you can go through them one by one and accept them. So that is how to manage messages and tags on Instagram. Be sure to visit the website for lots more tips on Instagram and all your favorite apps. And if you found this video useful, I'd appreciate you giving me a like and hit subscribe for lots more quick tips like this one. Until next time, thank you very much for watching.